Hey guys, what's up? It's Virtual, and today I'm going to show you guys how to fix a really annoying bug that happens in Elite Dangerous. So, uh, the problem here is that Windows actually assigns your devices differently when you uh, restart your computer. It's kind of a random process. So for me, I have two identical joysticks as my control setup. So I have a, a, a right joystick and a left joystick that I use for flying my ships. And sometimes when my computer restarts, Windows actually decides that my right joystick is all of a sudden the number two joystick, and therefore my right joystick does what the left one's supposed to do. Um, it's not exactly a problem with Elite Dangerous, but it is a problem with Windows, and I'm going to show you a really good workaround that I discovered myself on uh, how you can actually go about fixing this. I already have done a little bit of work uh, with this to set up two different control schemes, um, but I'll show you how I did it. I had to make sure this worked, of course, before making the video. Um, yours might be called custom, or you might have named it something already. If it's called custom, I'll show you how to rename it. So go ahead and do like a Windows R and go to App Data. Then you can go to Local. Let's see where it is. It's Frontier Developments. Elite Dangerous, Options, I'm actually going to go ahead and close out the game just for good measure. Alright, and then bindings, and now I have, you can see I have two different text files for my binds file. Now you might have a binds file called custom.3.0.binds. If that's the case, go ahead and rename it something. So for example, uh, name it something like dualstick.3.0.binds and then open up the binds file in your uh, text editor and put dualstick right here or whatever your uh, your preset name is going to be. And make sure it matches and then that's going to show up as your as your preset when you uh when you open up the game and check the controls. Now go ahead and make a copy of your, your binds file and name it something else like dualstick r.3.0 binds. And then also change that in here. So basically the idea is that if we change this device index value, we can actually switch what each stick does. So if I change my device index from one to zero, then my other stick does something different. <laughs> so it's a really strange thing. Um, yeah, device index is one, one, zero, yeah, so there's a zero index and a one index. So anyway, I have the R option opened up, and I'm going to go ahead and replace all. Going to edit, replace. Yeah, so I already have this set up because I tried this already. Um, let's let's search device index one, and then. And then we're going to set the, we're just going to rename it like this was one, so we remember it, okay? And then I'm going to do replace all. And then I can select my device index zero and replace it with one. Replace all. And then I can do device index, this was one, and replace it with zero. And now all of a sudden we have reverse device indexes. So as you can see on this one right here, the RZ axis device index is zero in the R file. And then this file, the device index is one in our regular one. So now we can go ahead and restart Elite Dangerous after we save the file, of course. Um, that shouldn't make a difference to anything. Just wanna make sure, yeah, so they're still reversed, good. So yeah, we'll go ahead and restart the game. Takes just a couple seconds for the game to load. I'll just go ahead and cut this part out of the video since I have to edit my name out anyway. Alright, Elite Dangerous is opened back up and my sticks are still reversed, but now I can go to Options, Controls, and I can set the R preset, and then I have to scroll all the way to the bottom to apply. Then I can apply it, and now my sticks are back to normal. Now I'm using my right stick. Um, now it is worth noting that if you're using something like teal joystick, your sticks are still reversed. So I'm actually using my right stick right now and maneuvering and stuff with my right stick. And it's it's uh, on teal joystick, it's showing the left stick. So in teal joystick, you just have to switch the, uh, the device index also, which is super easy to do. And I'll probably make a separate video on how to set that up. Anyway, I hope uh, this helped you guys out. I hope it helps you fix the bugs. This will fix two different bugs in the game. 
which is Windows um, editing your device index, and then also Elite Dangerous writing over your customs file. If the video helped you, drop a like and subscribe. I'll see you guys later.